see what we got. All right, line him up, Jose. You almost done in there? <laughs> Empty. $20 tub, though. Oh, well, it's actually etched crystal, believe it or not. It's like a whole set, 70 bucks. Yeah, you got a little $5 giraffe face, some kind of animal skin, 40 bucks, actually. Ah, a little helicopter, 70 bucks. Look at that, spoon collection. Yeah, it's definitely copper. And you probably got 100 bucks here, believe it or not. Extension cord, sanding stuff, 20 bucks. Heat gun, 20 bucks. Nice old can. 45 bucks on the can. Leaded glass coaster. 40 bucks worth of trinkets. And I still got what's left in the room. Let's go take a look. Yeah, you know, the refrigerator is 25 bucks. $10 in jacks. $30 in jacks. You know, this obviously starting to look kind of like a guy room. $25 in tools right there. Is it Tonra or Tonka? No, it says T-O-N. K A, right? Let's get this box out and see. Oh yeah, it's a Tonka truck. This is actually pretty cool. Well, Tonka stuff can go for thousands if it's the right one. Might be some more in here. Oh yeah, I think there is. Maybe it's a Tonka collection. There you go, car hauler. Now we're gonna have the semi that hauls it. Now, when I was a kid, you know, I would steal these out of people's yards because the kids would leave their little Tonka trucks. You know, on the way to school, I might just pick one up. That's the truck that goes to the car hauler there. That one's not stamped, but oh yeah, it is right on the tires, right on the white walls, Tonka. You know, these are like baseball cards, coins, trains. You got to take it to a Tonka toy expert. I think Tonka trucks will mean a Tonka money. What? Oh, Lordy. I love it. Oh, damn. I think these are going to be a little bit newer than that box, because these are all plastic ones. Oh, there's another box that says Tonka. Oh, he's got the old Winnebago. No way. I didn't see a lot of these growing up. This box is very cool. Set of interceptors. 100 bucks for the four. $50 chair. 100 bucks for the washers and dryers. $50 dishwasher. Got $100 in giraffe. I came, I bought, I conquered, just like I knew I would. Can't be afraid of a little work. Jose, he loves to work. <laughs> Hey, Dave, what do you got? Oh, Jim, I got some good stuff for you. When it comes to vintage toys, Jim Malley is my go-to guy. Let's separate out the uh, the cheap stuff, the beat stuff, the plastic. That's pretty cool. That's the original logo stuff, uh, Tonka Toys, Mound, Minnesota. Oh, cool. That's kind of neat. Uh, plastic. Plastic. A lot of these toys seem to be mixed eras, but these seem to be your best pieces best down there. here. So, Jim, what do you think this OK Pile's worth? Well, you know, all these pieces, you sell them separately at 5 to $50. I bet there's 500 bucks, and that's just the low-end stuff. Well, that's good. Now, yeah. let's get to the high-end stuff. All right, let's check it out. The collectors really like the pressed steel stuff. Yeah. And this is basically what you have here. They're all American. They're all heavy steel. They're quality toys that were made to last. And you can see, they lasted. So Jim, what are these good steel ones worth? This stuff here, this is the collector stuff. You can sell this to toy shows, sell it online. Um, you got $500 easy. Well, a thousand bucks for the whole collection? Sure. That's pretty good. Well, why don't you just stick around? We'll play with these for a while. All right, Mama, time to go camping. Let's go. Whee! Here we go. Yeah. Here we go. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world! 